Hi guys, Ash here from Escape Studios. Welcome back to Tips and Tricks Tuesdays. Today our tip comes courtesy of one of our awesome studio assistants, John Gresco. He's told us a great way to UV a cable in Maya. So very quickly here, using a CV curve and a cylinder, I've made a cable. I've got the cable the right size and length for what I want, but obviously when I come to texture it, the UVs are going to be a bit of a nightmare because of the shape. John's told us a quick and easy way we can get around that. Heading into my UV texture editor, so obviously you can see I don't have any UVs for this yet because I haven't made any. Rather than try and create the UVs with a plain R of cylindrical map, I'm going to go to Polygons and Unitize. Now what that's done, you can see there's a tiny orange line going around the outside of this grey square. Maya has crammed all of the UVs into that square and laid them one on top of the other. So every single face of my object is placed on that grey square. The next step is to select all of the edges on my cable now, holding control and double clicking, I'm going to deselect the two end loops, and then I'm going to select one of the edge loops that runs all the way through the cable, and holding control, double click on it to deselect that as well. So you can see I've got all the edges selected apart from that one running all the way through and the two end loops. Now I'll go back to my UV ed texture editor, go to polygons and merge and sew edges. Now, if I scroll back, you can see, even though they're huge, there's the UVs of my cable. Obviously, these are far too big to deal with at the moment, so I'll quickly scale them down and move them into the right area. Here you can see I've got a nice, accurate set of unfolded UVs in the shape of a cable. I'm just going to head up to polygons, go to unfold, and making sure that none of the edges are pinned, I'll just do a quick horizontal and vertical unfold. This stops the squares being so uniform and makes it a little bit more accurate. But you can see I've got a very clear representation of the UVs of my cable now. The areas where the UVs are all bunched up are the areas where the cable curves. This is a very easy technique for UVing anything cylindrical. So it doesn't have to be a power lead, it could be a phone cable, it could be a pole, it could be a snake. Anything that resembles this sort of shape can quickly be UV'd and unfolded with this quick and easy tip. So thanks a lot for that, John. If any of you guys have anything you want to pass on, please don't hesitate to get in touch. Hit subscribe now so you won't miss out on any more of our video content, and we'll see you next week.